Hello everyone, it's uh, Ewan here from DSUS. We are here at our winter testing grounds uh, in the Swiss Alps, currently above 800 meters above sea level here. And we'll be looking to do quite a lot of uh, exciting videos coming up soon uh, regarding search and rescue within a mountain environment. This is also a good place to do some testing on our payload system. Now, our payload system now comes standard with the version 2 Pro Search, and we're going to do a quick demonstration of how that works today. Okay, so quite a simple job. We're going to just attach this to the drone, we're going to fly it around, and we're going to do a scheduled drop. And we're all going to show you how that works. Very simple. You can use it automatically or you can use it manually. It's also quite a little, nice little package. Now, this is in combination with the gimbal, which you haven't seen here, but that's, an ex that's a video coming up for you soon. Uh, this will run alongside the gimbal, so you can do search and rescue and delivery at the same time within the same mission. Now, it's very wet here today. That doesn't matter. The Pro Search is waterproof, so I'm happy to fly today. Okay, on with the show. So, let's fly. Now you could fly this uh, out to wherever you want to go. We've got about a six mile range on this particular unit. <clears throat> but we're not going to do that for this demonstration. We're just going to go out and back to replicate a delivery mission. Now, typically we, we advise not to land, we advise you to drop payloads <coughs> purely because of the proximity to people and also to maintain signal quality strength. This is pretty simple, it operates all off a switch and all we have to do is just drop it like that. That's it, simple. Let's do that again. So we're just going to do a simple out and back mission here, just for the replication of this. But uh, so we have got a uh, six mile range on this pro search. It's completely waterproof. You can see that's the, how the payload is loaded. In front of this goes the gimbal. Uh, it's really simple to do a drop. I'm just going to flick the switch. That's it. 